Alrighty. So, first video, first self-made video. It's going to take some getting used to. I don't even know if I'm going to be editing this, so it could just be in its raw form. So, introductions. I'm Sheldon. This is my mustache not done up. It took two and a half months, approximately, to get through this. And I've had it for two and a half years, or something like that. Three years, I don't know. I, I lost track. But anyway, anyone looking to grow a mustache, I will try to give you some tips. If I don't, again, if I know how to edit the video, I will add stuff in later. If I can't figure it out, I'll put it in the description or something once I upload everything. But this is just a quick way of showing you how to do it. Or doing it my way, anyway. So, if you're in the bathroom, this is a lot easier. Mirror, gel, I just use Spiker Gel it's by Ice Hair. It's kind of expensive. I would recommend just getting some cheaper stuff. A lot of people use wax. I've heard that it can irritate your skin. And it's sometimes hard to work with. And it can really taste bad, smell bad. This stuff smells really good. It smells... I don't know. I can tolerate it. Let's put it that way. So, hair gel. Just... Buy the cheapest stuff, the stickiest stuff that you can, and you're not going to use a lot of it. But try to get some cheap stuff, just to try it out. Hair dryer, doesn't matter what hair dryer you're using, just as long as it has hot of air, and that is really all you need. And if you're in the, if you're in the washroom, obviously you're going to have running water. I just have a wet paper towel, just to wipe my fingers off once I'm going through the process. So... What you need to do, I don't know if you can see that, just a little bit, maybe like the amount of like a, a, a green pea maybe, maybe a little bit less, and um, The lighting is horrible in my room, by the way. So what you want to do is you want to dab it on the, the... Well, you can start with whatever side. Go with the right, dab it in the middle, and just... So you want to dab it right about here, and just run it through the length of the mustache. like whatever whatever look that you that you desire and do it to the other side and again you don't you don't really want to be using too much you can always add more if you need it but once it's in there and it's too much and it soaks in it's a pain so trust me on that one So again, you just want to run your fingers through like that. Very simple. You can use both your fingers. I use these four. These two, these two. This is whatever works. Run it through. Make sure it's somewhat symmetrical. If you can hear the music in the background, it's YouTube, and there's an ad playing right now, so just ignore it. Now this is crucial. For the tips... Because I curled them, you don't want to use too much because then they just become, I find, really saggy and they just don't hold well. So you would think more is better, but it, less is more. So, again, you can always add more. So just a tiny bit, about well, maybe half of what you would normally use for the middle, you use on the sides. And as you're doing this, when you put it in, you want to be dab it between these two fingers so you put it on your one finger 
um, spread it around on the two so it's equal, and then pull all the hairs together. Now you might want to trim before you do it, um, or you can trim after, it doesn't really matter. So you get something like this, right? And that'll just be from twisting it. And then... So as you can see, you're starting to curl. You're going to have to force it a little bit. But basically you do that, both sides. Again, if it's starting to unravel, don't worry about it, because we're going to use the hair dryer. That is the best method that I've come up with so far for keeping it intact. So we're done with the hair gel. Don't need that anymore. Wet paper towel. Wipe your fingers off. This is the most important part. One of the most important parts, anyway. You want to make sure your hands are clean. So get off all the excess hair gel residue so your hands are smooth and not sticky at all. Wipe all the excess off. Make sure your hands are dry, your fingers are dry. Because the next part you want to be able to move the curls in whatever direction you want and hold them and then use the hair dryer to go over it and not have it sticking. So just hold it like that, hold it in position, get your hair dryer. It's gonna be noisy, you're not gonna hear anything, sorry. Okay, so that is one. I don't know if you guys can see that or not. That is one, the left side done. Now when you're doing this, hot hair, really not good for your face. So also consider putting chapstick on and hand cream on your face or anything because it will dry out your skin. And try not to breathe. Like inhale and then once the hair dryer's pointed at your nostril, breathe out so the hot air doesn't go rushing up because then it'll dry out your nose. All these things I've learned over the past two years and a bit. Believe me. You'll thank me later. And for the last side... The last side. The right side? So. Again, I paused, inhaled, so I could exhale, so the hot air wasn't f flying on my nose. And... And you're done. Now, obviously... I'm a perfectionist, so obviously, 
depending on what you're like, you might look at it and just be like, yeah, it's good enough. I'm going out for drinks or whatever. Believe me, if you have long enough hair, you should probably do it. This, this is what I normally do. Wake up, brush your teeth, do your mustache, then eat, carefully brush your teeth throughout the day, and you're golden. If you need to retouch it at some time, go ahead. Uh, this normally... This normally will last all day. And depending on how you sleep, how much you move during the night, it could last two days. Barely. So, that's it. If you guys have any questions at all, anything, maybe I went through something too quickly, I don't know. I think it's a pretty straightforward process. And, yeah, just leave a comment, like a video, and if you have your own style, post it up, by all means. This is the style that I normally go with, just curled. I've thought about doing other styles. If you guys want me to do other styles, I can try. I'm not opposed to it, I just haven't deviated from that at all, just because I've been pretty used to this. And that is it. So stay tuned for other videos. I'm not going to be making a channel about mustaches because that. I don't think there's enough content. This is a lot of content, but <laughs> I don't think I can do it. So let me know what you think.